Good morning, HCC kids. My name is Pastor Brad, and I'm excited to have this little segment with each of you this morning. How many of you love to watch TV just like this? I know I do. I love watching TV. I love watching things like uh, Monsters movies, Spider-Man, Batman, Star Wars, right? All those cool shows. And my wife, she loves to watch things like Moana and Frozen, Beauty and the Beast. And she even likes that Hallmark channel that's on TV, right? That Blessed channel. And so there's lots of shows I'm sure you like. So let me hear some of the shows that you love to watch. Go ahead and tell me right now. Scream it at me, yell it at me. Tell me, what do you love to watch? That is amazing. I'm going to have to check some of those shows out. But here's what I want to do. I want to watch TV right now, don't you? Don't you want to join me in watching TV? So I'm going to turn my TV on, and I'm going to watch some TV right now. So let me see. I need to turn this thing on. Oh, that's right. i got to push this button over here. All right, I'm pushing the button. Where's, why isn't it coming on? Why isn't this thing working? It's, you know what? I know what I need to do. I need to use the remote. Right, guys? You're so smart. Thank you. All right, here we go. I'm going to... All right. Turn on. Turn on. Well, that's not working either. What do I need to do? What do we need to do for the TV to work? Okay. I got the TV. Got a table. I need my gaming chair. That's right. Let me get my gaming chair. All right. I got my gaming chair right here. Oh, wait. You guys can actually see this, can't you? This is not my gaming chair, I promise. All right, I'm gonna grab my mom's gaming chair. This isn't really mine, this is my mom's. So now, I'm gonna make sure I get this right. Okay, we're gonna watch TV, I'm gonna sit, whoa. I'm, I, almost, I almost got knocked out just now. I need the remote, the chair, the table, the TV, and now let's turn on the TV. Turn on the TV. Turn on. What am I missing? Why is this not working? I have everything that I need. Like I got the table, the TV, I got the remote, I have a chair. I just don't know what I need to do, guys. I, I don't understand what I am missing here. I just really, I, what? What should I do? Oh, I have to plug it in? I have to connect? You guys are so smart, I apologize. I don't know what I was thinking. So we got it plugged into the power, we got it connected, and let's see if right now the TV works, because if it works, you guys are the smartest people that I know at Hollywood Community Church. So let's see. I see a red light that's come on. I'm pushing the power button, and what's happening? I think it's working. We got it working, guys. You guys are smart. So. All I needed to do was connect the TV to the power source, and the TV now works like it's supposed to. You might say, Brad, what does that mean for us today in today's lesson? Well, God tells us in order for us as his disciples, as his children, in order for us to work properly as he's called us to work, we have to be connected. You might say, Brad, am I supposed to be connected to a power outlet? No, that's not what we mean. But we have to be connected to what then, Brad? We have to be connected to other believers. And I want to share a quick verse with you. It's found in Hebrews chapter 10, and it's verse 24. And it says this, And let us consider how to stir up one another to love and good works. What the writer of Hebrews is telling us is God has created us to be connected to other Christians so that we can help each other love the way God wants us to, that God has created us for good works for us to do, and we need other people, our friends, other Christians our age that can show us how to do those good works, how to love like God loves, and we are better together is what God wants us to understand. And so when we're connected with his church, when we're connected with other disciples, we are better together. Can you say that with me? We are better together. Would you join with me in prayer this morning? Father God, we thank you for your word. And Father, we know that as we placed our faith in you, that you have created us new. You've given us a new heart and a new mind and a new way to live, Father. And that is one that is being connected to your church here at Hollywood Community Church. So I pray for all the children that are watching this morning, that they would connect with their Christian friends so they can 
encourage one another to love and to do good works. And Father, would you put it in our hearts and mind that we are better together. We love you, and it's in your beautiful name we pray. Amen. Thank you.